Turkey has achieved another historic milestone in its defense and aerospace industry. Baycar, Turkey's leading drone manufacturer, successfully conducted the fifth prototype flight test of its innovative Bayraktar Kizilelma unmanned fighter jet. The test, which took place at the Akinci Flight Test and Training Center in Chorlu, marked a decisive leap forward in the country's ambitious goal of creating a jet-powered UAV. The successful PT-5 flight test is more than just a technical achievement. It demonstrates the growing maturity of Turkish defense innovation, as the country rapidly moves towards self-sufficiency in advanced air warfare systems. Kizilelma, meaning Red Apple, is designed to reshape the concept of unmanned aerial combat and become a symbol of national technological independence. The Bayraktar Kizilelma project was first publicly unveiled in 2022 as part of Turkey's strategic vision to develop a next-generation, unmanned fighter aircraft that can operate independently or in coordination with manned jets. Developed by Baykar Defense, the same company behind the world-renowned Bayraktar TB2 and Bayraktar Akinci UAVs, the Kizilelma combines stealth, speed, and artificial intelligence. The PT-5 flight test aimed to verify advanced aerodynamic stability, control software performance and engine integration under novel flight conditions. According to Baycar engineers, the test confirmed that all systems were functioning perfectly, with the aircraft demonstrating excellent stability, maneuverability, and data link performance. Baycar CEO Haluk Bayraktar celebrated the success by emphasizing that the Kizilelma's progress symbolizes Turkey's determination to dominate autonomous flight technology. Every test brings us closer to operational readiness, he said. The Kizilelma is not just an aircraft. It is the future of Turkish air defense. The Kizilelma PT-5 was developed based on data collected from previous prototype flights, focusing on takeoff dynamics, engine performance, and low altitude stability. The PT-5 phase goes further, testing higher flight speeds, airborne maneuverability, and autonomous mission parameters. This unmanned combat aircraft is equipped with a cutting-edge artificial intelligence AI system capable of planning missions, identifying targets, and making decisions without human intervention. Kizilelma can also coordinate with other manned and unmanned platforms, such as the Bayraktar, AKIN-C, or F-16 fighter jets, to conduct coordinated attacks or defensive maneuvers. With its jet propulsion system, Kizilelma reaches speeds approaching Mach 0.9, making it the fastest drone ever produced in Turkey. Its design includes a low radar signature, allowing it to operate stealthily in contested environments. It can carry payloads of up to 1,500 kilograms, including air-to-air -air and air-to-ground munitions, precision-guided bombs, and cruise missiles. The PT-5 prototype incorporates numerous technological innovations that distinguish it from previous iterations. Engineers have refined flight control algorithms for smoother maneuvers and enhanced the AI-based stability augmentation system, which allows the aircraft to automatically adapt to varying flight conditions. The aircraft uses a turbofan engine developed in collaboration with Ukrainian partners, generating the thrust required for high-speed, high-altitude operations. Future variants are expected to use an indigenous Turkish engine currently being developed by TEI, Tusash Engine Industries, thus ensuring full national production capability. Furthermore, the PT-5 flight test demonstrated advances in the autonomous takeoff and landing system, as well as an encrypted communication link that allows real-time coordination with ground stations and other air assets. These capabilities ensure the Kizilelma can operate safely even in highly congested or hazardous environments. PT-5's successful flight comes as Turkey's defense sector is rapidly transforming into one of the world's most innovative ecosystems. The country is gradually reducing its reliance on foreign suppliers while expanding its domestic technology base. The integration of Kizilelma into the Turkish Air Force will drastically alter the country's combat strategy. Unlike traditional manned fighter aircraft, 
This unmanned system can conduct high-risk missions, penetrate enemy defenses, and provide real-time intelligence and targeting support, all without risking human pilots. Furthermore, Kizilelma's compatibility with Turkey's TCG, Anadolu aircraft carrier provides a completely new operational dimension for the Turkish Navy. The drone's short takeoff and landing, as tall, capability allows it to operate from naval platforms, extending Turkey's air power projection beyond its borders. This marks a significant advancement in naval aviation and highlights Turkey's ambition to develop a carrier-based unmanned air force. Global defense observers have been closely monitoring Kizilelma's development, recognizing it as one of the most advanced unmanned fighter aircraft programs currently under testing. Analysts point out that Turkey has now joined a very exclusive group of countries, along with the United States, China, and Russia, developing autonomous fighter jets of this caliber. While many Western defense companies have struggled with the complexity and cost of unmanned stealth jets, Baycar's agile approach, combining rapid prototyping and local innovation, has enabled Turkey to advance at an unprecedented pace. The success of the Kizilelma has also sparked interest from several international partners seeking to collaborate or purchase variants of the platform. This could bolster Turkey's defense exports and cement its status as a global defense technology exporter. Following the PT-5 test, Baycar is expected to begin preparations for operational flight evaluations in collaboration with the Turkish Armed Forces TSK. The next phase will include weapons integration tests, combat simulations, and AI mission trials. Baycar officials have confirmed that mass production will begin once the aircraft meets all operational and safety criteria. The company aims to deliver the first batch of Kizilelma units to the Turkish Air Force and Navy within the next two years. Future variants, such as the Kizilelma B and Kizilelma C, are planned to feature twin engines, enhanced stealth geometry, and supersonic flight capabilities. These versions will likely form the cornerstone of Turkey's future unmanned air superiority doctrine. For Turkey, the Bayraktar Kizilelma is more than just a weapon. It is a symbol of technological independence and national pride. It embodies decades of efforts by Turkish engineers, scientists, and defense, planners to build a local defense ecosystem capable of competing on the global stage. From the Bayraktar TB2's success on the battlefield in various conflicts to the strategic evolution. Represented by Akinci and now the Kizilelma, Turkey's drone revolution has transformed the landscape of modern warfare. The PT-5's flight test is a clear signal that the country's aerospace ambitions are not slowing down, but rather accelerating. As Bayraktar continues to refine the Kizilelma project, one thing is clear. The future of air combat will be determined not only by stealth and speed, but also by intelligence, autonomy, and national innovation. And Turkey is positioning itself at the forefront of that future. Forefront of that future.